My name is Russ Sorrells, and uh, we're here with uh, Mr. Robert Frady today, and he's going to talk about his journey, his experience with his amputation, and give us some some feedback. So we're just going to talk through uh, again, you know, what what he's been through and in, in his experience, not only uh, with this situation, but you know, at some point we'd like some feedback on your experience with Kelvin and uh, and POI. I had diabetes and it didn't get any blood circulation down to the foot and the gangrene set in my foot so Dr. Terramino amputated my le left leg. I was going to walk again and that, I made that my first priority. I knew that at least I wouldn't be in pain like I was before they cut it off. Now when you get gangrene it can get to your heart and bloodstream and it can kill you. Ooh, wow. So I was thankful I was alive and I said I'm gonna make the with a positive attitude that I was gonna walk again. They to do the exercises, I did them. They asked me to raise my leg five times, I raised it ten. Then when they got where they asked me to raise it ten, I raised it twenty. I doubled everything they asked me to do. I had that positive outlook. And when they discharged me at the hospital and sent me to proof health over here, they said I'd be over there for approximately three weeks. I was out of there at the end of one week. My biggest challenge was to get get to the shower and get in the shower, <laughs> take my shower and get out and dry try to dry off. Thankfully, I have a wife. She helped <laughs> me through that process. Yeah. But that was my biggest challenge. Eric walking, Kelvin told a, a helper he had here, he said, here comes a man. I'm gonna fit him with his process, prosthesis today. And he hadn't took a step in it. He said, he'll be walking before he leaves here. He fitted me told me to walk down that rail. I walked all the way to the end up, turned around and came back, and then I started walking without holding on to the rail. And Kelvin said I was his favorite protege, protege because I did more than what he thought that I'd ever do. Yeah. And I told him my biggest goal was to go play golf. And I have been able to accomplish that. So the Lord has really blessed me. I don't let this leg come in the way between me and Lord Jesus Christ. I don't blame nobody for what happened to me. I've got that positive outlook. Hey, this is a new day. Make the best of it. And don't ever sit there and feel sorry for yourself because look how Christ suffered for us. And like I showed, I can dance and I can run on this thing if I have to, but um, I just, I have had the best experience with Orthonic Prosthetic Institute and Kelvin of anybody and I'll come and stop in and just to speak to him and say hey when I'm passing down the road if I'm over in this area. Yeah. Uh, he's always glad to see me and I'm always glad to see him. That's awesome. Well, thank you so much for taking the time. I'm sure this, what you said today is going to inspire other people and help them well, I sure through, their, so. through their process. And 